We don't know why, but the bad guys steal our dreams, mess with our heads. Bells said they also take things from our rooms, like familiar personal stuff to help them brainwash us with their creepy machines. Anyways, tonight, we take something back. Club's calling y'all. Bad guys carry evidence of our last botched mission. Swipe it for us, please. You got it. Yeah, game's trying to make me feel like I'm in like a group of kids all working together, but without co-op partners, it doesn't really feel like that, you know? Definitely better played with co-op. Different surfaces make more or less noise, by the way. Like, concrete's kind of loud, grass is quiet, I think? I think so? Unless the tall grass is loud, I'm not sure. Ooh, bonus evidence? Let's see if we can go in the back way. HQ's got the next, uh, step. New... Shit, I couldn't read that. It was covered up by the other thing. Find the first fire. First fire will be on a shrine in the maze, so that's down below, right? Yeah. Alright. It's the way down over here. I believe. Uh, not quite here. Right here. Oh no, that's the- shit, it's the red door. That doesn't take me down. I thought it was a hatch that went down. Um... Whoa. They are so maneuverable. You know what? Let's try to look for a way down through a different house. See if we can find some bonus evidence? Let's do some cool stuff, shall we? Let's do this. That's cool. Where it shows it's going to hit is a lie. It does not hit exactly there. Also, that doesn't reach the ground, so... Um, it'll be fine. We can do this. Oh, I can't grab it back while I'm on it. I hope this doesn't break my feetsies. I'm scared. Oh, we're fine. Oh, right, you can't open windows. They have to already be open. Well, this doesn't work, does it? We're such a good climber. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh, 
doggy. That's evidence. Evidence of dog. Gotta take my own pictures, you know? Oh, I already went in there. Damn. Let's go down to the first floor. Oh, 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 oh. I kind of want to just pin them, but they don't stay down long. Wait, what is this? Snack? I assume that restores my stamina? Thankfully, we're on, like, carpet, so it's really quiet. Alright, I'm just gonna pay you. <laughs> Alright, let's go fast. Oh, well, that's a very obvious way down. That's kind of weird for it to just be in the kitchen like that. Any bonus evidence? No, you stay down. Stay down. Front door. Uh... Nah, we gotta go. Let's take a look. That's what I need. It even highlights when I look at it, but I can't grab it with the drone. The drone doesn't have any handsies. Well, there's a ladder right there. It's pretty straightforward. There's also all these pillars that you could get up on. That would be nice. Although I'm not sure how I get down to the right level. Oh wait, there's a ladder over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take that beam. Controlling the beam. I think we're fine. Nice. Hey, look at us. Technically competent. <laughs> and what's the club got to say? Put it in some thing. Find container, put first fire in container. And that's up. Is there any evidence down here? Oh no. Hide now. Whoops. Who heard that? I didn't realize I was holding that in my hand. Doesn't seem like anybody. Yeah, I have to keep it in my hand. I can't even switch to something else. I'll have to drop it and then switch to something else. So we're gonna be pretty careful. It glows really brightly too. It means it's a light source. It's right on the other side. Uh, if I open the carport door, it'll make noise. I love this glow. So ethereal. Ugh. There it is. 
What was next? Exit. Good. And um, now we um. Can we get level three? Yes. PowerPoint earned new maze areas. New threat lucids. Okay, so now there's going to be people that can actually see me. And then I think when I reach level four, that's going to unlock a whole new area, right? Like this one. I'm going to save my skill point until I have two so I can get the next level of UFO. And also, let's change, change out our hero item. Let's try the stun I gun. Shocker. <laughs> I love the voice acting, it's really good. Let's go back in. This description seems the same as one we just did. Maybe the last one or the one before that. Club members missing, crime scenes, blah blah blah. Evidence is everywhere, we just gotta find it. See, so yeah, I think the missions are just random. Yep, just record evidence. Straightforward. Ooh, drink dart. Nice, that will, I think, permanently put them down. Non-lethally, of course. And what about this thing? Like, does this non-lethally put them down permanently, or...? Also, does it ever run out? That's so cool looking. Let's try it out. Oh, god, I think we finally have a different house this time. So far, all the quests, I think, have been for this one house on the corner. <laughs> See if we can get some bonus evidence. Ooh, pants. Lockpick. All right, let's get out of here. Ooh, two of them. Oh, right, there's going to be lucids now. I forgot about that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, I'm going for it. Ugh. Ooh, I want to get up in that treehouse. But I don't think I can now. Because I don't have my thingy. You know, the thingy. I want to try this thing out. So I think it just instantly puts them out so that you can then grab them? Uh, I'm gonna wait for them to get up and do it again. The child is oh no! It didn't work. It has. Oh, it's out of battery. Maybe you just have to. You probably just have to wait, huh? All right, let's pick the lock. Let's get in. So now there is a point to not using my flashlight in case I come across a lucid. 
But I'm assuming a lucid isn't going to be in one of these places. Weird. Okay. Oh. I don't know. <gasps> Is that? Oh, the battery's back. It is expense. No one wants to Creepy enough? And what's the club got to say? Member kidnapped, cut them loose. Oh, hell yeah, that's something new. Maybe this serves as a sort of infinite escape item? The way escape items work is like the trank dart. If you don't have an escape item, then you take damage when you kind of like push somebody away to get when they get up on you and grapple you. So if you don't have an escape item, you take damage getting away. But if you do, then you just automatically use that item like the trank dart. And I'm sure there's other stuff too. And then you get away without taking any damage. And I wonder if this serves as that. In that case, do I not need to have it like actively equipped? Will it just be used? I don't know, but it's a good thing for when someone's just there, you know? When they're just right in front of you and you're like, oh crap. I like it. Grappling hook is still super cool, though. Find a way down. Here we go. Two lockpicks. Now down here is where I expect to find a lucid, so I'm gonna put away my flashlight. Take a look. Fine. Hmm, this is open now. That wasn't open last time I came here. Whoa. I think this place is pretty much clear. What if I can jump on top of that thing? Wouldn't that be pretty cool? Oh, I can see somebody playing this this wire here. See it moving? Probably being played by a lucid. I can't get down there safely. Here we go. I hear somebody up there. Person's tied up right above me. Report. Her body's attacked across weary. Signs won't be visible in the morning unless it is resting soon. Got you, buddy. Don't worry. Hey, that part's done. But now what? Okay. Next. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right, they can see me. Oh, that was scary. Let's heal myself. Uh, uh. Uh oh. 
Oh, it's that cave where we first started on the first mission. Those are supposed to look like city lights down there, but they kind of just look like embers, like whole valleys burned. Where can I safely jump down? Uh, this might be fine. Uh. Oof. That sounded worse than it was. Guessing right, the team multiplier, if I had four people in here, would be four? Which means I would earn four times the points? Probably. I mean, it might not go up one with each person. Maybe 0.5 or something. But I think my leveling's gonna be way, way slower like this. Okay, I'm gonna try going to a public game. I set the network to public. Uh, it's probably going to be hard to find people to play with because this is a pre-release special version. It will probably only be other YouTubers and Twitch streamers and whatnot. And I also have voice chat off, by the way. I, Sorry, I do not want to voice chat with anybody. It just feels way too awkward. So let's see what happens. Like, do I go into a thing where I wait for other people? While we're young, maybe. Like, how do I get into a public game with other people? It's not just the parents, teachers, and cops, it's something way older pulling the strings. The whole dang town versus, well, us. We need to show Red Acre we ain't afraid, so just fake it. <laughs> Wake folks up, get them to join, or if things go bad, replace us. Maybe... Probably what happens is that as long as you haven't finished the game, it's open and other people can join while it's in progress, right? Because there's no reason you all have to start at the same time, is there? So, we'll see if anybody else joins. There is text chat. I don't... How do you do text chat? Enter? Yeah. You press enter. They can do that if they want to say hi. <laughs> of course, there's nobody else in here right now. Pick up six supplies. Oh, is that evidence? Oh yeah, supplies. Or wait, that didn't count for picking up the supplies? Still a zero out of six? What was that then? to zap them. So what are the other things I picked up? The posters. Place hold F. A poster to recruit new kids for the Blackout Club. We need to let people know they're not alone, that we're in this together. This is a yard sign to recruit them more. Hold F to place? It's not something I can just free select, though. So there must be like a specific spot that is highlighted and I can use them on it.
plant the yard signs. Careful, they're allowed to put in. Oh. <laughs> yeah, there's still nobody else in here. My ping is zero? Is it because I'm the host? So basically, put in. Whoa. Oh, I stepped over it. I didn't even see it. Basically, put it in all the yards. There's a sleeper right here. I see why it's loud, because we're hammering them into the ground, right? That makes sense. Oh, and I've already got some of them. Cool. Good. And, um, now we, um... That's good, right? Place them in the that maze down below. Okay. Cool. So now we, um... Guess I'll just go in a random house? Yeah, why not? Uh-oh. We're good. Uh, uh. I hate how the flashlight, like, flashes as it gets too close to the wall. It, like, turns off, goes away, comes back. It's really disorienting. Ah, just more bandages. That's the top floor. Makes sense that the entrance to the down would not be the up. <laughs> Might be lucids here. I think I could reach that pillar. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> what does that say? Juvenile offender report. It's a picture from a drone. Close your eyes. Ah, oh, it's got a message if you close your eyes. I'm too close to it, though. Wake up. Look around you. something different. Maybe I could shot the camera. Damn. I remember there was a Lucid that surprised the hell out of me here last time. 
Gotta get out of the way of the camera, though. Snack. What do they have on those conveyor things? This red carpet stuff is super quiet. I remember that from the prologue. What is this? Weird. Go to the red door. Where's this? Yes, all these doors are things that will be unlocked, like as I play more and level up. Like when it said a new place in the maze has been unlocked. It was one of those. What's in there? Get it. Oh, jeez, that scared me. Oh, no. Oh, that's a lucid, isn't it? They can see. I need to get out of here then. Where did you come from? Oh, right. They can see. Oh. again. I've put up one poster down here, the one that was up in this area. Let's get the others. Let's do a little bit of sweeping and then go back to walking. See how you like it. Okay, I need to get up there. Oh, I think I see where to go. That or kicking the door in. Yeah, okay. Let's go up above. We can go up here. Oh no. Oh, Jesus Christ. It scared the hell out of me. The angel's after me! 
What? Oh no. What did I do that... I guess just... grappling people and stuff? Yeah, up there should do. Right? Oh no. The shape is there. Can I, uh... No, you can't do that. Oh, do you just die instantly? Ah, that's frustrating. Back down, trying to put the posters in the maze. I came in from a different place this time, though. So we want to go that way. Oh, oh god. Oh, Jesus. Damn, I can't believe that worked. thought they'd hear it or the camera would change and see me. This big room. Okay, so we got a poster to put up there. Yeah, the shape? Shape is no joke. I wonder if you can do anything to make it go back into the red door. Or if it's just after you for the whole rest of the round. It probably is the rest of the round. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go up. This time, I don't think I've done any sins. I haven't tased anybody or knocked them out. Oh, Jesus. Why the hell did that happen? Grab it and then I just like let go. Mm. I don't have a lockpick, so I won't be able to get in that door. I might be able to kick it down. Wait, did one of them open it? No. Who is? No one. Cool, weird contraptions. Okay, I need to get up there. What's over that way? Oh my god, there's like giant air sacs. And a huge red carpet. How do I get up there? I don't know if I can. I don't think I can. Entering the arches. All right, this room. Cryptogram library. Oh. Sleep tripwire. Oh, never had that before. Thirty snacks for bandage. Fifty for trank dart. Thirty for flashbang. Thirty for energy bar. Uh, I'm good. I'm saving up for a, a hat or something. I 
still need to get back up. I guess I'll just go back over to where I initially got up. I still don't have a lockpick. Oh, no, no, I do. Someone heard me. like a quiet floor. Maker. Oh, here. evidence. Man, look at him go. Look at him go. Creepy. Talented. get to the exit? Good. And, um, now we, um... That makes walking silent here, but only in a very small area. a good way to go to get out, I think. Go, 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 go. Man, I really need a bandage. There's the shape right down. Oh my god, I almost fell off. Fucking hell. Does the shape always know where I am? I assume so. It's coming up the ladder. Wait, back here? No. No, no, no. Um, oh no! Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Okay, here. Throw that. Doesn't hurt me. Whew. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. 
Shape is not anywhere to be seen. Oh, this was a real hard one to do. I imagine this game gets a lot easier with multiple people. I mean, you get more points to level up and you have more people to help you out. We came, we saw, we still need a catchphrase. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and what I've realized is that this game, I mean, I didn't realize this, I knew it was definitely meant to be played with multiple people, but it almost has to be. I, I can already see that it's gonna get pretty repetitive if I don't, because I think progress will be too slow in terms of leveling. And I get way, way, way less XP, obviously. Stuff is harder. So I think what I'm going to do is wait for the game's full release, full official public release, and then try to play with other people. I'll still leave my microphone off, though, <laughs> but I'll try it out. So thanks for watching, and I'll be back soon-ish. Probably a delay between this episode and some of the next ones, because I've got to wait for the game to come out first.